bees honeycomb is an amazing piece of engineering but why have they evolved to produce this hexagonal pattern well actually they don't have too many choices if you try to put pentagons together for example they just don't fit together nicely or circles leave lots of little gaps if they want to produce a network of regular shapes which fit together neatly uh, then you've really only got three options you can do equilateral triangles or you could do squares or you can do the bees hexagons but why of those three does the bee choose the hexagons well it turns out that the triangles actually use much more wax than any of the other shapes squares are a little better but it's the hexagons which use the least amount of wax it's a solution that was only mathematically proven a few years ago Bees start the construction of the hive from two or three different places and weave the honeycomb simultaneously in two or three strings. They start from different places. The bees create a number, construct identical hexagons and then weave the honeycomb by combining these together and meeting in the middle. The junction points of the hexagons are assembled so deftly that no defect can be found in the structure of honeycomb. Look at the, it's, it's perfect, yeah. hexagons here. Yeah, it is amazing. And uh, the hexagon is a very strong structure. It's uh, an engineering wonder for sure. Then it means that there's an exalted wisdom that rules over all these tiny creatures. Or in other words, the creator of these tiny creatures inspired them with what they have to do. And this fact was declared in Quran 14 centuries ago. The worker bees, those who gather pollen and make honey, are actually all females. The male bees do not make honey. This was only known recently. However, the mentioning verses pointed out to this fact 14 centuries ago. The Arabic words Kuli, Fasluki and Butuniha are all in female forms, whereas the male forms of these words are Kul, Fasluk and Butunihim. So by using the female modes of these words, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala informs us that the worker bees are the female ones. Moreover, these verses pointed to another recent discovery. Bees build their hives from their own wax. However, scientists just discovered bees that build their hive in wood and even in solid rock. And your Lord inspired the bee. Set up hives in the mountains, and in the trees, and in what they construct. <laughs> 